Daniel, do you consider this to be a crucial game? Yeah, I think it's a big game for us, uh, without a doubt. It's a it's a big game, and and uh, you know we're uh, we're excited for the opportunity. So we're going to do what we always do and prepare and and, uh, and get ready to go. But uh, we're excited to get out there. What about your offense? Where do you think it's at right now going into this game? Uh, I think we've done some good things uh, at times, and and uh, you know we we haven't executed as well as we've needed to at times too. So. Uh, we've got to be more consistent. Uh, got to find ways to uh, to sustain drives and, and score more points. And how do you get off to faster starts? Uh, I think we've moved the ball well uh, the first couple drives. You know, first couple drives and two of the games. Um, I think we got to finish with points, finish in the end zone, um, and execute all the way down the field. Uh, you know, and score with touchdowns. So it's just about uh, sustaining that execution. I think this team has found its identity yet. I mean, it's still early in the season. Teams sort of take time sometimes to do that. Um, I think we're still we're still improving. I mean, we're still still working to to grow and and um, like I said, I think there's a lot of things we need to sharpen up and clean up uh, as an offense, as a unit, and we're working to do that. But uh, we're still confident and uh, excited for for what we can be. What do you take when you look back at the matchup against them last year, and then how much of that do you think carries over? Uh, they're good defense. A lot of the same players as last year. Um, so definitely, you know, we'll study that and, um, you know, some differences here and there and what they're doing this year. But uh, a lot of the same stuff shows up. It's a similar system. So, um, yeah, I think we'll look to look to that uh, where we can, but understand it's a new year with with uh, a different team. So uh, we'll have a good game plan. Be ready to go. What would it mean to have Saquon in the lineup? Uh, yeah, I mean, he's an important part of our team for sure. Um, but he's, he's working as hard as he can to get back. And, um, you know, if he's ready to go, I'm sure he'll be out there. How optimistic are you at this point that you have a chance to have him back? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think that's a that's a Dave's question. Uh, I know he's working hard and, and uh, trying to get back. You guys have been running those on power sneaks, whatever you want to call them. Is there anything different for you when you run those as opposed to just like a regular sneak? Uh, not really. I mean, you got a little, a little extra help, um, you know, but other than that, I mean, it's the same thing. You're, you're just trying to keep your feet, feet moving and, um, get that yard. How do you practice them? Do you, do you practice them or is it just, is it um, need to be practiced? We, we do them in walkthrough. I mean, we practice them in walkthrough, but, um, it's kind of a hard thing to, to practice full speed really. Seattle's uh, past defense has struggled the first two weeks. Is there things that you can take advantage of there, do you think? Uh, yeah, I think, um, you know, they're, they're a good defense. They've faced some some uh, dynamic offenses and good passing attacks, good scheme, and, um, and good players. So, um, you know, there's stuff you can learn from there. But we have a lot of respect for their, for their defense and, and who they have. Daniel, how do you get started earlier? I mean, the first half has been – you know, six points in three games. Yeah, I think we got to sustain the execution. We got to sustain drives and finish in the end zone. So, um, you know, got to got to take advantage of our opportunities to do that, and uh, we'll certainly look to.